Hi, my name is Bethany Vernon. I am a designer, sexologist, and author of the Boudoir Bible. I am also a certified clinical hypnotherapist specialized in matters of the heart, intimacy, and relationships in general. Since the COVID-19 pandemic started to spread across the planet, the majority of us are obliged to respect the mandatory virus prevention protocol of social distancing, confinement, and self-isolation. These behaviors are in glaring contrast with human nature, and they are putting our mental and physical health to a test on a global level. Anxiety, loneliness, and frustration are triggering traumas, old and new, on a collective level. Considering that most of the world is affected by the coronavirus, it is very likely that you have already witnessed or experienced firsthand the negative effects of long-term confinement and isolation on the body, mind, and soul. Like most of us, and especially if you are isolated alone, you are probably also longing for physical contact. This is totally normal and to be expected, because just like any other mammal, humans are neurologically hardwired to give and receive pleasure through the sense of touch. Humans also depend on physical contact with each other to communicate properly and to feel emotionally balanced. Touch is to survival, what cuddling, hugging, and of course lovemaking are to happiness and a life well lived. When we exchange positive physical contact and emotions, various glands in the endocrinal system are incited to secrete hormones like dopamine, oxytocin, and serotonin. These naturally occurring mood regulators do not only make us feel good, but they are good for us too. Negative physical contact and emotions, on the other hand, incite the secretion of mega doses of stress hormones like adrenaline and cortisol. Stress fragilizes the nervous and the immune systems, so it is paramount that we keep it at bay, and especially in times of crisis like the ones we are currently navigating. Until the pandemic is under control, we must be open to exploring alternative ways to fulfill our innate instinct to touch and to be touched. The sense of touch is a crucial aspect of all human relationships, from work to play, from socializing to making love. Those of you who are isolated alone are presented with an even bigger challenge when it comes to managing the effects of sensual deprivation. But essentially, no one will be spared the consequences of obligatory confinement and physical distancing from the ones we love most. During confinement, it is crucial to make daily rituals of self-love and self-care a priority. I created the following hypnotherapy session to alleviate the physical tension and the emotional frustration that sensual deprivation causes. It will make you feel more connected to yourself and to the ones you love to love, no matter how far away they may be. During the session, I will guide you inward, deep into the unconscious mind, where negative emotions can be eradicated and positive emotions can be cultivated and reinforced. The experience will induce a profound state of relaxation and possibly give rise to physical sensations like you have never experienced before. But before embarking on this journey, I would like to remind you that my method has nothing to do with entertainment. Unlike those who practice street or stage hypnosis, which you may have witnessed in the media, under no circumstances does this or any one of my therapeutic sessions aim to make you think or do anything you do not want to think or do. During the entire duration of the session, you will be present. You may even find yourself thinking of other things, and this does not matter, because hypnosis speaks to the unconscious, not to the conscious rational mind. You will feel deeply relaxed, calm, and well during and long after the experience. You should take advantage of the benefits of this session at a time of day in which you will not be disturbed by anyone or anything. Choose a quiet place where you can lie down and stretch out on your back. Make sure that your phone is turned off or in airplane mode. Turn the lights down low or light a candle if you prefer. Now is also the time to push pause and go to the toilet if needed. For once the session begins, you should not be interrupted in any way. You may listen to the following audio experience as often as you wish, but please do not listen to the recording while you are driving, operating machinery, or moving about in any way. In the future, feel free to skip the introduction and start the therapeutic recording from this point. During the session, you are free to move and adjust your position as needed. If you have an itch, scratch it. And if you feel the need to cough or to sneeze, don't repress it, but please do continue to respect the coronavirus protocol. Do not cross your arms, your hands, or your legs, and your feet and fingertips should not touch each other either. 
you will be totally in control of yourself. You are simply going to enter the altered state of consciousness that is induced by hypnosis. Without your being aware of it, without your thinking about it, you are actually in this modified state of consciousness, this trance state, most of the time. It is not a sleep state, but your conscious rational mind will finally be allowed to take a rest and for the entire duration of the session. Now that you are comfortably installed, I invite you to look up and fix your gaze on a real or imagined spot on the ceiling above you. Fix this point and take a nice deep breath. Fill your lungs to the brim and then exhale slowly and allow the worries of the day to fall away and release all of the tension in your face. And while you continue to fix the point on the ceiling, inhale again deeply. Fill your lungs to the brim one last time. Hold it. And for a couple of seconds longer if you can. Then exhale slowly. If your eyes are still open, allow them to close. Down. Tight. Now. It is as if your eyelids are soldered, closed, now. So, if possible, I would like you to imagine that your forehead is transparent, like crystal. And it is so perfectly crystal clear that you can see through it. So, roll your eyes back as far as you can now, while continuing to fix the point over your head. Continue to gaze through the forehead, transparent like crystal, and continue to gaze. And you may feel a certain tension in your eyes, and this is okay, because it means that you are following my instructions perfectly. Your eyes may also be fluttering or moving rapidly by now, and this is also a good sign. It means that you are letting go. And it means that you are prepared to move into the peaceful hypnotic state that is induced by the emission of what is known as the theta brainwave frequency. While you continue to gaze through the transparent forehead at the point on the ceiling, roll your eyes back again, now as far as you can, and then relax the eyes completely. If you can, allow the eyeballs to fall back into the sockets now and float, completely relaxed. You may feel if the eyes are floating in the sockets, and when the eyes are totally free from all tension like this, you will notice that the entire face is suddenly more relaxed too. If you have not done so already, release the jaw and in the other areas of the face that are still holding tension, you will sense that when the face is relaxed like this, the entire body relaxes with it. Continue fixing the point above you on the ceiling, and because you are following my instructions perfectly well, you will notice that the point on the ceiling is becoming larger and luminous. Stay in the moment. Don't take your eyes off the point. Follow it, and you will notice that it will start to descend. Slowly observe it, and you will see that it is moving towards you. Slowly, so let it descend until it is hovering just over the top of your head. Then allow it to expand like a cosmic body of light and you may feel its warmth as the luminous cloud of relaxation composed of an infinity of particles of relaxation poses itself gently on the top of your head. And you may sense that this luminous cloud of relaxation is offering you a delicious yet nearly imperceptible massage. Become aware of the pleasurable sensations it has to offer and let them wipe away every last bit of tension 
from the forehead, the eyes, the jaw, the entire face, the neck, and the shoulders. Release all of the tension. Just let it melt away now. And as the luminous energy cloud caresses the head, it begins to fill the relaxed face, neck, and shoulders with a deep sense of relaxation. And all these particles of relaxation are beginning to descend slowly all the way down the back of the neck. And they enter the muscles of the neck and they continue moving downward like tiny sponges. Just let them wipe away every last bit of tension in the neck and descend into the muscles of the shoulders. And the neck and the shoulders are completely relaxed now. And you may feel the warmth of the cloud of relaxation as it continues moving downward into the back and into the chest. Let this healing energy expand inside you and you will feel it continue its downward journey through the back through the torso and into the belly where the luminous energy cloud pools and swirls. Take note of its power to relax every single trace of tension in the body. Then let the luminous energy cloud move over into the left arm. Into the left arm and let it continue to descend all the way down the left arm and into the left hand and into each finger of the left hand. And maybe you can feel a warm, tingling sensation in the palm of your hand now. And maybe you can imagine that you can collect this energy force in the palm of your hand now and hold it for just a moment. Then. When you are ready, pass it over into the right hand and hold it again in the palm of the right hand until you feel the warmth of the cloud of relaxation starting to move upwards again. Effortlessly, it moves upwards and all the way through the right arm, all the way up and into the right shoulder. And there, you can feel it spreading into the left shoulder and you feel its relaxing effect and you continue following the luminous cloud of relaxation calmly and consciously and you can feel it and you allow it to accumulate at the top of the spine. You may feel the energy cloud begin to swirl here at the top of the spine and this is fine because from this point in the body it can move downwards and spiral all the way down the spine. Let it spiral all the way to the bottom of the spine, releasing all of the tension in the spine and in the back before it collects and possibly swirls again in the sacrum. And from this point at the base of the spine, the energy cloud cannot but continue its journey through the body. So let it expand and release all of the tension as it goes through the body, instilling deeper and deeper states of relaxation along the way. And you can feel it moving downwards into the left leg, the left knee, the left calf, the left foot. And you can possibly feel the luminous energy cloud as it spreads over into the right foot now. Just let it continue its journey through the body moving upwards now and into the right calf, the right knee, the right thigh. And by now, the right leg may be left and the left leg may be right and it does not matter because you are totally free of all tension. And the luminous cloud of relaxation continues its journey upwards so easily. And then it moves through the chest and straight into the heart. Just let the energy accumulate here in the heart and swirl around the heart. The body is completely relaxed now and it is pressing into the surface where you are lying and it feels 
as if you are being pulled to the center of the earth and you feel centered and you feel gratefully grounded now. And while you are there and I am here, I wonder if my here is your there or if it's the opposite. Either way, it does not matter because you are in a bubble of security now. You are relaxed, so relaxed that you do not need to relax or seek to relax. You are ten times more relaxed than when we began this journey inward, so do nothing but take awareness of your breath. You are calm and well. You are actually better than well. So I'm going to ask you to forget to remember and to remember to forget. And the better you feel, the more relaxed you become. And the more relaxed you become, the better you feel. And you may notice that it is easy to forget to remember and to remember to forget in this relaxed state. When you allow yourself to glide deeper and deeper into this healing state, this modified state of consciousness, and you are this safe, and you are this secure, and you feel this good, you just let go, and you're going deeper and deeper. And it feels good to be this deeply relaxed, and it feels good to let go. Let go of all of the tensions, and it feels so good to allow the mind to rest. And all you have to do now is listen to my voice. And while the right arm is left and the left arm is right, or the other way around, it does not matter. Because the bottom line is that you are well, better than well. And you are going to go deeper and deeper. And you are not obliged to listen to me to hear me. And you are not obliged to hear me to listen to me. And you are more and more relaxed than when we started this journey into the unconscious mind. Deeper and deeper. Continue to breathe naturally and calmly. Continue. And now that you are here in this deepening state of relaxation and you feel deeply relaxed, you are ready to continue. So look just in front of you and tilt your head ever so slightly. You will see a stairway and you will have the sensation that you are looking down this flight of stairs. And you can actually see these stairs from where you are now. So as I count backwards from ten to one, you are going to go down these stairs. These stairs that lead deep into the unconscious mind. And you are ready. You are ready to go there now. So step, and you will feel your feet stepping. Ten. You are standing on the first stair, and you can feel the weight of your feet on the first stair, and you feel safe. And you feel confident. So continue moving. Nine. You can see your feet are on the ninth stair. You feel well and you feel relaxed. So keep on moving forward. Eight. You can see the eighth stair under your feet and you can feel its support beneath your feet and you advance because this is not difficult for you and you are ready to continue. Seven. It is actually easy, and you see your feet advancing, and you feel calmer and calmer. And with each step you take, you feel the release of more and more tension from your body. And six, you feel safe and confident, because you know this stairway, or because you know that I will guide you safely down these stairs, and you feel good. So, you know that you are moving in the right direction now. Five. You may realize that you are beginning to feel light. Yes, your body feels much lighter than when you started the descent down this stairway into the unconscious mind. And rather than stepping, you might feel more as if you are floating down the stairs now. And four, this is becoming so easy. And all you have to do is listen to my voice. You are following my instructions. And it is easier and easier. And you see your feet. Three, on the stair. And you may note the sensations of relaxations instill themselves deeper and deeper into your body. And with each step, you are lighter and lighter. And you can feel that you are going deeper and deeper into this pleasant place of deep relaxation. Two, you are stepping or floating downwards and you don't have to think about how you are doing this. So, one, you find yourself there on the bottom stair and you are free. 
So feel free to step forward and into the middle of this beautiful room. Look around you here, and you will see that everything in this room is to your liking, because this is your room. So anything that you may see in this room and any sensations that you may feel in this room are yours. They are yours alone, and they are here for your pleasure. So take the time you need to get familiar with this room, and take the time you need to get familiar with your surroundings. Is this room furnished? Have a look at what you see. Are there objects in the room? If so, it's because they are objects that make you feel good and free. Feel free because they are here for you, like the color of the walls, your favorite color. Everything is to your liking here. So look out the window now. Look out, and you will see a view that makes you feel even more welcome and more serene, and you realize that everything about this room is pleasing to you. And you may smell a perfume that you recognize, your favorite perfume, or the scent of someone you long to see lingering in the air. And you feel all the more deeply relaxed for it, more and more deeply, and you feel free here. And you feel safe, because you are safe. You are safer than safe. So choose a place, your favorite place to just be in this room. It may be a bed or a simple mat or cushions on the floor. It makes no difference. Just choose whatever makes you feel welcome and settle in. Settle in so that you can continue to go deeper and deeper. And you are ready to go deeper and deeper into this place of relaxation and wellness where you can connect deeper and deeper. And now I invite you to focus from this place of deep relaxation and wellness. All of your attention inwards towards your heart. Focus all of your awareness on the miraculous source of life and love and compassion that is right there in the middle of your chest. And from this sacred place of security and deep relaxation, allow yourself to connect more and more deeply with the heart. Focus your attention here where all of your positive intentions and emotions bloom. And when you connect with your heart like this, you may notice and you may be able to feel the warmth of the heart vibration. And it feels good to be here and you feel grateful. You feel grateful to find that it is so easy to connect with the heart. It is so easy to connect with the heart when you are in this deeply relaxed and serene state. So, if possible, I would like you to visualize a flame. A flame burning in a cave at the back of your heart. Contemplate this inner light. Contemplate the divine sparks that trigger life and imagine that each breath that you take fans this flame in your heart. And this flame, it feeds your soul. Take a moment to give thanks for all of the joy that your heart has given you and all of the love and kindness that you have experienced in your heart and through the hearts of others. You know the power of the heart vibration because you experience the power continuously in your soul. And you feel and you have felt the power of love and kindness and compassion. And what we experience and what we feel is real. So take this time to go deep, to go deep inward and tune into the pure silence of your heart and listen. Yes, 
Just listen to what your heart has to say. And as you listen, you may also hear the heart beating. Connect to the rhythm of the electric beat that is sending a continuous vital flow of life energy through your entire body. Abandon yourself to these gentle sensations and allow yourself to go deeper and deeper with every beat of the heart. The vibration connects you deeper and deeper and you may perceive the vibration of the heart energy radiating, radiating outwards in waves and you may notice the vibrancy of these energy waves mounts with every beat of the heart. Just observe the energy, free from doubt and judgment, free from the need for reasons or explanations. Just watch. Just watch and you may see that the more you become aware of your heart energy radiating, the more you sense the vital energy flowing from the source, the powerful heart energy also radiates color. Some people see the color violet, some green, others multicolored waves. No matter what you look at, it does not matter. Because all that matters is what you see. And you can see the heart's electric undulating energy now. And it is always there. And the more you focus on the vibrant heart energy radiating, the more you see it, and the more you become aware of the compassion that is budding in your heart. And from this place of deep relaxation, in this room that is dedicated to your peace and pleasure, you can feel your heart vibrations becoming more and more radiant. And the more you feel, the more you feel the powerful heart energy vibrations radiating, the easier it is to abandon yourself to the sensations that the vibrant power of love provides. And you may sense a comforting warmth growing with each beat of the heart. Your love is growing and expanding. And from this place of deep connection and wellness, you may begin to sense the presence of an invisible pathway. An invisible pathway that leads your heart to your brain. Take a moment to perceive this presence. Then, shift your focus from the heart to the area between the eyes and just behind the forehead. Draw your attention to this area in the brain and you may sense a subtle vibration there just between the eyes and you may also see a subtle energy vibration and you may perceive that the energy has a certain color or luminosity. Some people see shades of indigo and no matter what color or level of luminosity you may see or not, you will sense a subtle flow of regenerative energy rating from this area outward. Outward from this area in the brain, just between the eyes, behind the forehead. I'm going to give you a moment now to focus your attention on and connect to this point. And while you observe this energy, you may also begin to see the waves undulating, vibrating, and pulsating. Allow the energy to flow and swell and swirl while you continue to focus your awareness inwards. And you may begin to sense that the connection between the heart and the brain, the invisible pathway that leads the heart to the mind and the mind to the heart, does not pass through the intellect, but you are able to access it now with ease from this place of deep connectivity because it is from this place of transformational relaxation and inner calm from where you are 
that you can sense and you can access the energy pathway that connects the heart to the brain and the brain to the heart now and whenever you wish. And you can sense the continuous flow of energy moving back and forth from the heart to the brain. From the brain to the heart, it flows back and forth effortlessly through the invisible pathway. And when you feel this relaxed and well, and when you are this deeply connected to your heart, and you can actually feel the energy flowing back and forth between the heart and this point in the brain, and all that matters here and now is that you continue to focus all of your attention on the continuous flow. Just observe what is happening for a moment longer. It feels good to just be here and to observe and to listen and to feel the vibrant power of the heart energy radiating in and around your heart without your having to do anything at all but just be there. And now, allow your awareness to expand with each beat of the heart, outwards and into the entire body. With the energy that is radiating now from the heart and flowing out and into and through the entire body, you may notice, if you didn't notice it before, that as the heart beats, it sends pleasurable waves of sensations and waves of wellness throughout the entire body. Continue to abandon yourself completely. Abandon yourself completely to these pleasurable sensations and let all of the energy that you have been generating in your heart radiate. And you may feel its warmth and all you need to do is just let the luminous energy waves pulsate through you your entire body, from the heart to the head, and from the head to the toes. And with each beat of the heart, the luminous energy wave rolls through you. And you may notice that as this energy is expanding outwards now, it may be surrounding your entire body now. And it is as if you were in a protective shield of energy, and you feel safe, and your entire body is enveloped in this vital undulating flow of healing energy, and it is as if your whole body is being held, held in this all-encompassing regenerative hug of love and bliss, and the deeper you relax into it, the deeper these sensations of relaxation and wellness will instill themselves in you and around you. Let them hold you, surround you, all around, deeper and deeper. And now, you are ready to purify your heart vibration by letting go of any emotions or any thoughts that are not attuned to the heart. Just acknowledge any negative thoughts or negative emotions that may arise now and release them. Because negative thoughts and emotions don't serve you, so let them go and they will vanish just like that into the nothing that they are. Because to simply acknowledge negative thoughts and emotions is to let them go and become part of the past. Let them go. And now, with a pure heart, with pure intention of love and compassion flowing through you, I invite you to dedicate all of this purified ecstatic heart energy to yourself. Dedicate it to yourself and to the unique universe that you are, to the universe that is you. And With each ecstatic beat of the heart, I encourage you to turn the frequency of your self-love up a little, and with each beat, a little more. 
Turn up the frequency of your love vibration. You are worth every bit of this bliss. And because you accept the energy of your self-love, you can bathe now in this ecstatic wave of pure heart energy that is lapping at every cell in your body now, pulsating, undulating, waves. Let them sweep continuously through your entire body, and you may perceive your energy field expanding now, and you may see the energy surrounding your entire body now, and your entire body may be enveloped in this vital flow of blissful sensations and deeper and deeper states of relaxation. Deeper and deeper they accompany you all the way to the core of you. Because you, yourself, as much as anybody in the entire universe, deserves your love and affection. Stay with these sensations a moment longer and you may notice that your body feels light, even lighter now. Because when you are free from all negativity, you actually feel lighter. And when you feel lighter and your energy is pure like this, you actually become lighter. And when you are in this deep state of relaxation and loving self-care, it is so easy and natural to feel connected. And all that matters is that when you feel this energy and you are more and more aware of its deep regenerative flow in this ideal state, you feel good because from right there, where you are right now, you are opening the doors to your body pharmacy. And you are doing this without doing anything but following my instructions and staying in the moment and you bathe in the waves of wellness. You bathe in these waves of wellness that you make available to yourself when you allow yourself to go deeper and deeper. Just like this. And you may notice that the more you accept these pleasant sensations, the easier it is to connect to yourself in this place of wellness that is in you. And this regenerative flow of energy that is overflowing in you now like a purifying wave. It rolls through your entire body and the more you let go and the more you release every tension in the body, the waves of regenerative energy continue to roll through the body. And as you release the energy that is generated in the heart, you notice that nothing happens to the energy, that it does not change form. And this is because energy has no form. But when energy is moving like this, it can be collected and transformed and stored so that it can be retransmitted later elsewhere. Using energy simply means controlling it. Yes, controlling its movement rather than consuming it. And now that you know how to move the heart energy to and from its source, and you know how to turn up its frequency, and now that you know how to purify the heart's energy too, and to use it for your own good by letting go of all negative emotions and thoughts, the time has finally come, and you are ready. You are actually more than ready to use your purified heart energy to connect beyond the confines of your own body with someone special that you love and care about. Prepare to move all of the electric power of the heart energy back inwards now from your body and from around your body. Move it back towards the heart. I will give you a moment to do this to recollect all of the ecstatic energy that you generated and draw it inwards, back into the heart, by simply pulling your attention back inwards towards the heart. And focusing all of your attention on your heart, you pull the energy, you pull the purified energy back just like that. And you can feel 
your vital energy essence of life and love return. All the way back in. All the way back into the heart. Just like that. And now, all you have to do to make the connection is think of a special person that you care about and that you miss. The person that you have in mind now the beloved that you cannot be in physical contact with at this time, that you cannot hold in your arms today. Continue to think about this person. Focus all of your loving attention on this person. Focus all of your loving intentions on the energy that your love for this person is generating in your heart right now. And you may even see the beloved in your mind's eye now. And you may notice or feel a certain warmth radiating from your heart. And no matter what you see and no matter what you feel, continue concentrating all of your purest loving intentions and thoughts into the hearth, into the flame that is burning in the back of your heart. Let the energy warm there in the flames that feed your soul. In the name of the person that you are thinking about and that you want to send your love to. Let your thoughts and your love warm here in the hearth of the heart. For the heart is to love what the sun is to the earth. And like the sun and anything else that radiates heat, the heart radiates energy. And it moves energy in waves. Continue to focus on the love in your heart. Then, when you sense that the waves of your love are expanding, let them swell. And when your heart feels like it's bursting with love again, you are almost ready to release your love and share your love heart to heart. You are following my instructions so perfectly well. So this is as easy in this state of bliss and wellness. This is as easy as thinking of the recipient of your purified heart love vibration. So with every beat of the heart, while you think of this person, turn up your love frequency. Let the love vibration rise up higher and higher. And when your heart is filled to the brim with this love vibration, Release it. Let it go from your heart. Send it straight out, straight out and into the heart of the person you have in mind. Straight out and into the heart for the person for whom you have been cultivating this pure love vibration. Let it go. Just like that. Straight out from your heart. Let it fill the room you are in now. And let it move out through the doors and flow through the windows of the room you are in and send it farther and farther out. And you may see the electrical frequency of your love vibration emanating like a luminous wave of light from your heart out into the cosmos. Love travels like light in waves, so it does not need matter or material to carry it because the energy of love travels like light through time and space at hundreds of thousands of kilometers and hundreds of thousands of miles per second, just like light. Continue to release your love vibration just like this, straight out into the heart of your beloved, and you may feel its warm, luminous energy swirling outward straight out from your heart. Because love travels this fast and this far to any place in the world that you need it to go and in real time. So just let your love flow from your heart. Let it undulate through the energy fields that emanate from and around every living thing, connecting us all as one. And your love can travel like this 
wherever you need it to go. And I promise you, if the person you are loving right now, from right there where you are, is aware of your love for them, if they are attuned to your love for them, they may feel your love now. Because love travels in ecstatic waves in real time like this, and because you are having this experience now, and you know this now, you can allow your love to flow freely into the hearts of the ones you love to love, just like this, and whenever you wish. And it feels so good to connect, and it feels so good to express your love deeply and freely like this. I will leave you a last moment of silence to feel the power of love like this. Our journey inward will come to an end soon, but before you return to your day or to your night, bring your attention back to your own heart, taking inward time to cultivate love for yourself and your loved ones, reinforces the heart energy and activates the endocrinal system much like a hug or making love does. This not only feels good, but it is good for us too. Our happiness depends on the quality of our relationships, and while our relationships may be forever changed by the COVID-19 pandemic, our need to love and to touch and to hold the ones we love will go unaltered. And now that your body, mind, and spirit are fortified with the energy of love, you will return to the here and now to the count of three. One, when you practice and experience love like this, you become love like this. Two, you are calm and relaxed, but coming back. So wiggle your fingers and your toes and bring your focus back to your breath and breathe naturally. You feel the cool air coming into the nostrils and the warm air exiting the nostrils and you may begin to perceive the light on the other side of your eyelids. Three. You are ready to return to the here and now. Right there where you are. And if you haven't already opened your eyes, do so now, slowly. Welcome back. I hope that you enjoyed this experience and that it helps you to manage eventual bouts of loneliness and love-related anxiety or frustration. The unnatural behaviors imposed on the majority of the global community by the protocol will leave a collective scar, but trust that we will soon be communicating our love for each other again physically, face-to-face, hand-to-hand, body-to-body, and always heart-to-heart. In the meantime, Take advantage of the silver lining in this crisis that is allowing us the time to reflect and to explore and deepen our self-understanding and our understanding of the value and importance of basic values like love in our lives. And feel free to share the journey with the ones you love to love. This will reinforce the impact of the session and your sense of connection. If your biorhythms are deregulated by the coronavirus protocol, take advantage of this session at night. Before you go to bed, the deep states of relaxation and pleasurable sensations that it instills will help to regulate your sleeping pattern. And be gentle on yourself. It is as simple as making self-love and self-care a priority. If you are suffering from COVID-19-related anxiety, take advantage of my dedicated complimentary hypnotherapy session here on YouTube. And... If you are interested in working personally with me to manage and eradicate anxiety, stress, phobias, depression, addiction, and insomnia, as well as the detrimental effects of sex-related abuse and trauma, please go to bettinyvernon.com to book an appointment. Thank you, and be safe.